Betty Klopp says she's been holding on to this hair and skin for nearly 45 years. Of course I've kept it. I wouldn't give it up for anything. That's because she believes this belongs to Bigfoot. But is a large forest dweller really out there? Oh, definitely. I don't think people should go around shooting them if they find them. Klopp says her parents saw what could have been Bigfoot when they were driving late at night. Klopp says her parents were going in this direction, towing a small trailer, when they swerved off the road to avoid hitting what they believed to be a man. She says that they stopped at the Porter Creek store to assess what had happened. They got out of the car, searched the area, but they found nothing. Klopp says the next day, her parents discovered the pieces of skin and hair snagged by the trailer. This is something you don't run into every day, sort of, I mean, quite literally run into every day. <laughs> Klopp says the material was sent to the University of Montana for testing. The results showed the DNA was too deteriorated and the hair too degraded to make any identification. There's reports that somebody has one and has shot it and is storing it in his freezer. Klopp says she still believes in Bigfoot and wants answers. In Roseburg, Didi Gatton, KPIC News.